sides that deserve to be there. Unbeaten all the way through the competition. 100% record for one of them. One draw for the other one. There's confirmation. It is Indonesia that managed to go through their group and the semi-finals unbeaten. Thailand dropping the points against Vietnam, but topped the group courtesy of goal difference and then overcame Myanmar in that semi-final. Things are out in force. Indonesia will take on Thailand to see who will win gold. Will it be the first ever time that Indonesia has taken a gold medal at the SEA Games in football? Or will Thailand, seven-time champions, make it eight? Moving on to the starting lineups then. Definitely a force change from Indra Shafi. Michael comes in in the left-hand position due to that red card in our hand. Two yellows in the semi-final. There's a change in the middle of the park where Rayhan misses out for the more burly. Talfani, who scored that late, late dramatic goal in the last game. As for Thailand, Lizaro Sitaro makes three changes himself. Yatsa Korn has been sacrificed to bring back in Achapol. The big surprise is that Puricet, the man that has dazzled us all the way through this competition, is dropped to the bench. Jai Pipak comes into the middle of the park to shore things up. And there's a change at left back as well. Okay, down's done. Kick off begins. Thailand going right to left. Straight away, a little trip there. With the 20 minute mark here now, this game is absolutely flying by. Defender with the ball in. and it's happened in the final. This time, Alfendra with the ball in. It was another flat throw, and Ramadan Sananta makes absolutely no mistake with the header. Flicked it on, it didn't look as though he took a deflection going in then. There's the throw, there's the header, and that's the knee of Songchai. Not in front of his man, Songchai gets in front of his keeper. And again, it's another dream start for Indonesia. of the game. Shocking defending. Songchai and Kandik don't deal with the ball, but Ramadan Sanata just goes and attacks it and just flicks it straight into the air. It's his second, but it's come at such a pivotal time in the game. The drop ball, the long ball forwards. Songchai doesn't deal with it, Kendi doesn't deal with it. Sanata has just gone and attacked the ball. And who said football is a complicated game? There's nothing wrong with that at all. Long ball punted forwards. Your striker attacks it, gets something on it and flicks it over the keeper who's in no man's land. And before you know it, it's 2-0. 90 minutes is what's required. 45 minutes is what is left. And Thailand got another game that they can move into. Well, sat yourself down. It's going to be 
Thank you for watching, please like and subscribe.